bless. Okay. Today I'm making dog blood herb, dog blood bush tea, that's it. I've got some here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to boil up some water and then um, in a separate pot, put the herbs in this pot, let it seep for like 20, 25 minutes and then go from there. So with this herb, with this bush, it's good for fertility and any fertility issues. It's good for clearing the fallopian tubes. So it's, yeah, it's amazing for women and the reproductive system. So what I'm going to do, I've come off my cycle maybe about a week or two ago. So I thought, you know what, it's the perfect time to try some of this tea. So I'm just gonna go ahead now and get started with it. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm only making one cup. Okay, we're going to start that again. I almost bun down the house. I had my tripod on the actual hob. Wait for that to boil the water. In the meantime, because I'm making one cup and I'm probably going to use like reuse the herb, so I'm just going to maybe have two spoonfuls. That's the first spoonful, and that's the second. So I'm just going to wait for the water to boil to add it to it. That's the water now. So with this herb, I've wanted it for so long. I've wanted to try it. And I got it last month, if you saw my video of when I went to go get some herbs. And I'm all about clearing the systems. And yeah, I'm, I'm so excited for trying this. I'm, I've heard such good reviews about it and when I went to the herb shop and they had dog blood I was like yep immediately but it was a little bit more expensive than the others as you can imagine because it's very not difficult to get but I mean I've been wanting it for a good couple of years now and I've got it so just going to wait for it to boil up Now, a lot of people like to use sweeteners in their teas. You can use agave syrup, you can use date syrup, coconut sugar, honey. There's so many different sweeteners that you can use. For me personally, I don't use any sweeteners at all. I like to taste the herb as it is. If it's bitter, it's bitter. If it's mellow, it's mellow. I just take it as it is. But obviously, it's your preference if you want to when drinking teas if you like to have a sweetener then that's your choice but if it's bitter it's good for the liver and we love herbs that are good for the liver okay the water has boiled i'm just gonna move the camera I'm just gonna pour the water over just gonna stir it And then I'm going to cover for 25, 20 to 25 minutes. That'll do. Okay, so it's been 20 minutes. Let's see. That's how it looks. It smells a little bit like guinea hen, if you've had guinea hen weed before, tea, and um, yeah, it smells good, let's, let's taste. Mm. Yeah, it's very similar to guinea hen, and if you've had guinea, guinea hen weed tea before, you know when you have guinea hen, it has this very interesting taste and you can smell it in your breath as well. And also I believe that it allows you to like flush out as well. 
so maybe it's because it's like quite like, there's a lot of like sticks and things and it's yeah very very similar to guinea hen but very nice very good i'm going to use the herbs again one more time um, to make another cup later i'm just going to let it seep in the water but the second time i use it i'm going to boil it up with the water to get the rest of the nutrients out of it but the first go around i just add the water to the herbs but yeah i feel like maybe one more spoonful of um the herb would have made it a little bit more stronger obviously um but because i don't have much i wanted to like savor it but it's very good very nice very well this one is very mellow i can taste it on my mouth not a bad thing not a bad thing but if you are going to talk to someone or if you're going to go out definitely brush your teeth or brush your tongue clean your tongue but yeah this is just a quick video for me taste testing the jamaican dog blood herb tea bush tea i never know how to say it. jamaican dog blood herb tea but yeah if you have tried it what's your thoughts on it and let me know how your body responded to it i will definitely keep an update on yeah how it goes for me and yeah thanks for watching bless